Hi everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. <sighs> Getting the January readings knocked out. <sighs> I gotta get as many done as I can today because tomorrow I have to go to the doctor. Because the reason why I wasn't reading cards yesterday is because I was in bed all day. Um, the edema in my feet is acting up. So... I was told that the next time that happened, I needed to make a doctor's appointment. So hopefully we can get that under control and manageable so I can actually like sit at my table without my feet screaming at me because it's very hard to have them flat on the floor. Anyway, it's a little bit better today, so I'm knocking out what I can get knocked out. All right, Pisces, enough of my jabbering. We're going to throw down your cards for January 2021. January 2021. I know, it's hard for me to get used to, too. <clears throat> All right. This reading will be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 2021. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. You choose to do anything at all. It's your journey, not mine. I'm just reading cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay too. You can check your moon rising or Venus sign readings. Just keep in mind time and energy are both fluid. And all things can and maybe vice versa might play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And dear friends of cross watchers are always welcome here at the fire sign tarot table. One more reminder before I throw them down. If it is not your reading and it is not your message, it is definitely not your story. Leave the cards on the table and walk away because shouldn't take what doesn't belong to you because that's how fights get started. Okay. Pisces, why are you here? Ace of Swords reversed. I'm going to fight. You know what? I'm not fighting with it anymore. Ace of Swords reversed. Mm. Lack of communication. Who are you not talking to? How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Five of Cups. <clears throat> Pardon me, either they're a sad person or they make you sad. What do you think of them? Queen of Cups reversed. Oh, I love it when it all becomes clear to me. Do you think they are emotionally closing off from you? What do you want from them? The tower. I'm thinking this is going to be a common theme today. Hmm. Wow. Throw a clarifier on that one. I'm catching a sense if it's all going to come tumbling down, just make it happen. Okay. How do they feel about you? Four of Cups. They're in a state of contemplation, possibly. Wondering if they want what's in the cup. They're looking at the cup, but... There's three full cups over there. Well, at least the cups are still standing. I'm not sure what they're full of. Hmm. Hmm. What do they think of you? Ten of Wands. Burdensome situation, perhaps. 
possible they think you got too much on your plate as it is. Or they think you have something you need to get off your chest, something you need to relieve. What do they want from you? The chariot, forward movement. Either they want forward movement or they want to put distance between you, huh? Oh. It's the obstacle. King of Wands. Hmm. Could indicate confrontational energy. Could indicate energy of a certain nature. Sugar and spice, all things nice. Sexual nature. I try to dance around it. Sometimes you just gotta be out with it. I'm sensing aggression, though. Not necessarily like fisticuffs aggression, but... Probably someone wanting to move forward a little bit too quickly. Hmm. Possible resolution. Seven of Cups, is re Seven of Pentacles reversed, huh? All right, well, let's leave that for a minute. Ah, there you are. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards and tips for Pisces, please? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January Pisces, it's your card. Are you the one not talking? One more on that. The Hermit. Ah, oh, okay. Contemplation. Could be a Virgo or another Pisces you're dealing with, possibly an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I got a lot of water. A little earth, a little fire. Mostly water right now. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Why is the Five of Cups here? Oh, landed sideways. Hmm.
One more. Emperor Knight of Cups. Could be an Aries. More water. More water. They got their crap together. They're in charge. They're in control. might be a bit of a heartbreaker. <sighs> they got it going on, but they're breaking hearts. Why is the Queen of Cups reversed here? Could be a Scorpio, could be an Earth sign. Something's changing in them. It's a resurrection. One more. Well, the Hierophant and the Seven of Cups reversed. They may be uh, a little bit emotionally closed off, you think, because they want to slow things down, possibly. Not quite sure where to go with it. With the Hierophant, there's definitely a deep connection here. I got a lot of majors. One, two, three, four, five majors up there right now. Six, seven. Ah. Wow. I'm feeling a little bit of hesitation. Why the tower? Five of Pentacles, the Eight of Cups reversed, and the Tower. You guys aren't communicating. You're not talking. You're going through some dark, cold times right now. Somebody's emotionally withdrawn. Somebody's sad.
I think it might be you. one more on this tower. Mmm. King of Pentacles comes out. Do you want to give him the world? But sudden and abrupt change needs to occur. Something needs to happen. Something needs to shake things up in order for this return to come and the dark times to end. Hmm. Okay. Why the four cups? Why the four cups? for how the other person feels about Pisces by the Four Cups. Hi. Yep. Not talking, not communicating, not trying to push it forward in a state of contemplation, vulnerable, one more. Not quite sure how steady that foundation is. It's not coming together. Not sure how stable this is going to be. Why the Ten of Wands? reversed. Yeah. I just think something has you very burdened. Releasing some Potentially toxic stuff. Probably whatever's causing the sadness and hesitation. Ten Pentacles. Now that's the ten you want. The big brick house with the white picket fence and the 2.5 kids and the dog in the pool. And <laughs> Sunset sipping lemonade, watching the kids chase fireflies around the backyard. That's the stuff. King of Cups upright. It's definitely emotion there. the chariot. Two cups. It's 
Let's move forward. See where this goes. Ooh, three came out. I definitely want to talk. Why not? Mm, I don't like that Seven of Swords. The Star, the Seven of Swords, and the Five of Cups reversed. Oh. I don't know. I mean, the Seven of Swords does not necessarily have to mean lies and deception. It's not always what it means. It can mean just making plans. Doesn't necessarily have to be some shady. Why mm. the Seven of Swords? They definitely want to end the sadness. They they want they want healing. They want that cosmic connection. They want their star. See, there's a star there. There's a star on that pentacle. You guys are mirroring each other a little bit. Mirroring each other a little bit. The chariot and the ten of wands. Another chariot on top of the chariot. We don't make plans. End this burdensome cycle. Move forward. We want to help you heal. First, you have to return to a place where you can. Something's got to change. Something's got to give. Why is the King of Wands here for the obstacle? Why the King of Wands? Eight of Wands reversed. That's telling me because it, it, Eight of Wands can be forward movement. Drop the transmission on the truck of life, maybe? Engine's still going. <laughs> it's not going anywhere, though. Ace of Wands reversed. <clears throat> Hesitation. Somebody's hesitating. One more. Nine of Cups reversed. Happy. Oh, that's a mood. That's a mood, Pisces. Why the Nine of Cups reversed? Having a light bulb moment. Two of Swords. <laughs> That'll be one of the drop of a hat. Somebody's really in deep contemplation here. Somebody's afraid of getting hurt. It's almost like, I'm going to hurt you before you hurt me. Wow. Wow, you're happy. You're happy, Pisces. Go with it. You're happy. If it's going good, let it go good. Don't be all like, well, things are going great, so it's you know, bound to end any second now. Don't be like that. Don't be like that. Why is the Seven of Pentacles reversed here for the possible resolution? I, I love it when they fly out and go underneath the chair. Especially when I'm in leggings. I hate leggings. Leggings are not my thing. Neon wears them all the time. They're not my thing. Four Pentacles.
that's telling me to just kind of Knight of Swords reversed, Four of Pentacles upright, Four of Swords reversed. Top of a Seven of Pentacles. Somebody's losing patience. Somebody's getting restless. And they're not talking because they're still holding on to stuff. Somebody's still holding on to stuff. One more. There it is. Nine of Swords reversed. Get a lot of your head. You're holding on to stuff unnecessarily, Pisces. Or somebody is. Wow. Wow. What's the result? What's the outcome? Page of Pentacles reversed. I don't like that badness. Why the Page of Pentacles reversed? Nine of Wands. So back to that sexual energy thing. All a king of wands is, is a knight of wands that settled down. Okay. That's all he really is. <laughs> so, I hate to say it like this. This is what the cards are telling me. This is what I'm feeling compelled to say. I don't know who's doing what or who's on what side of what, but whoever's hesitating because things are going a little bit too good and they're just afraid it's going to end, you could cause the end. You could cause the, okay, well, you know, if you don't want to settle down with me, I'm just going to move on. Moment's over. I don't know if that's what you want so you can avoid getting hurt, but if it's going well, let it go well. Just saying. That's what I'd do. Ten of Swords, Eight of Swords. Don't cage yourself up in red flags that don't exist because you will cause a painful ending. That was pretty short, sweet, and to the point. What's the other deck got to say? The sun and the four of wands reversed. If it's going well, don't cause the tower. If it's sitting on a solid foundation and things are going good, don't cause a tower moment. Don't. Why change a good thing? Pisces, I love you. This has been your reading for January. I'm going to check out. I want to get at least, at least one more done, maybe two, before I got to get ready to go to the bread and butter job. So... Whew, 
I love you guys. You guys have been wonderful over the last couple of years. I appreciate the views and the comments and the blessings because it's been a rough couple of years, so, but we're going to get better. I'm going to get better. The channel is going to grow, hopefully, but you know, let's not put the cart before the horse. I have my medical stuff that I got to think about. So, I am fully confident that 2021 is going to be our year. But we'll see what the doctor has to say tomorrow. I love you. Be blessed. I'll catch you guys Friday for the weekend top and bottom of the deck.